What's up everyone? One more day here with another episode of the show Rig on Fire. Today we're gonna check this donor guitar here. The cheapest guitar that I found on Amazon. Can a $159 guitar sound good? Well, before go any further, let me remember you. This is my second channel, my main channel is in Portuguese. So, if you are from Brazil, check the link below for the Portuguese version. As I said, today we're gonna check this, what is the name of this guitar? It's DLP 124B from Donor. It's the one of those cheapest guitar on Amazon. Is this guitar cool? Sounds okay? Sounds good? Uh. Well, the last time that I put my hands on the guitar with that range of price was maybe 30 years ago. I was young and I just started to play guitar. And, and that, that kind of guitar is it's made for beginners, right? But, you know, some things that I always keep in mind when I test the new guitar. First, the intonation. That means how the, the, the chord sounds over the fretboard. If sounds tuned. Two, how do the pickups sound like? I mean, I'm talking about uh, clarity and tightness. I don't want a mud sound, even on the cheapest guitar. <laughs> And number three, playability. If it's possible, play any techniques or tappings or palm muting, whatever. <laughs> Well, for me this little cheap guitar is more than expected. There is there is two little issues on this guitar in my opinion. Uh, first of all, I don't think this is a problem on this model, as this is on, on this particular guitar. The machine head, the first machine head here has a little gap. When you tight or loose, uh, there is a, a little gap between the the, the machine here, I don't know, I, I think it's, it's just this first one, the problem. And the second issue is the fretboard edges. I think they could do a better job on the, the edge of the, the fret here. I can feel the frets a little bit when I rub my hand around the fretboard. And But it's not a, a big deal, it's very easy to, to fix. It's not something that can disturb your playability, you know. So I think that's it. I'm going to leave the link um, for this guitar on the description field below. Uh, it came with a um, um, gig bag, a cable and a strap and a couple of tools to set up the guitar. Well, I hope you guys like this video. Check this album, it's my last album on this digital platforms and this video as well. Every link for this kind of stuff is on the description field below. Uh, thanks for watching. 
Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up, I'm out.